community spirit and communities at the heart of football clubs. That's what we'll always remain true to. And I think that's what's really special about Brentford. You get a sense of family with the club and the extended community. We're in reaching distance of the ground and, and the offices and we're in, in a local park, but look at the energy. We've now got a uh, hundred staff and volunteers in the community, multi-sport, male and female, and we've got a very, very broad range of activities. We link into social agendas, so we try and work with people that really need some help or an intervention to maybe change pathways. We're working with children on the edge of care, young carers, giving them opportunities to get involved uh, socially with different programmes. And we respond to our local conditions. Recently, we've been working more wider age groups with a programme called Fan Active, looking at exercise programmes, looking at healthy lifestyle. That's been really, really positive for the participants. Using sport to improve lives. It began obviously with children, but it's so wide now. And not also forgetting our learning zone that is based at the football club. It's a purpose-built classroom. It works in a range of media to engage all ages in different ways, using the power of sport again in a different setting. It's really quite powerful. The club are doing a great job in terms of opening up the club and opening up match days to you know people that aren't currently engaged you know when you think about sport it's so wide and it's so engaging and it can have so much of a profoundly positive effect on communities the club's embedded in its community it goes right through the club in every person you meet the energy that you feel and the passion about sport and the game and the club comes through and that's what's so special about Brentford.